We're looking at a Ferris IS2 2100. This is a commercial mower. It's on the uh, lower end, I guess you would say. But um, it's a very well-built mower. As you can tell here, it's got um, the good heavy mud flap, similar to the one that's on the gravy that I, Gravely that I like so well. Um, you can see the bumper's real heavy, which is a important part. Obviously, you got a lot of money hanging back there. I mean, most good mowers aren't going to, or mowing guys aren't going to be backing into a lot of stuff, but it works good like if you're pulling up on a trailer and parking other mowers close to it. You know, it kind of helps protect that uh, pretty good. But, uh, and this is a good size mower uh, as far as the, the deck is really one of my favorite sizes. But, um, you know, the most, I think the most sought after thing or the most appreciated thing on these mowers, obviously, is the suspension. You can see here that it's loaded up pretty good. It's not, uh, it's got it on the front and the back. And until you mow with something like this, it's, uh, you just don't you don't really know how nice it is i mean if you've got a rough yard it's really it does really well as far as um fitting in the small valleys or ditches and rolling over humps and holes and stuff it's it's a it's an awesome ride for a zero turn mower plus one uh positive to that is not having to buy an expensive seat so uh that's one nice thing this size, uh, to me, is is a good size. The problem I have with it is when you drop into a lower grade, or not necessarily a lower grade, but a smaller commercial mower, you sacrifice your width, not only in your deck, but your, in your whole mower, which seems to make it not as stable. Or you, you know, with your wheels and tires, they just tend, they're narrow. Um, I mean, I guess it's more of just the way that it's all proportioned out, but they seem to scoot around a lot. This one here in particular has got some, uh, the tires on it aren't, I mean, that'd be good if you had, I guess, more of a turf-like yard, flat yard, but they just don't grip very good. This thing scooted really bad. It didn't tear up a whole lot, but it just didn't grip a whole lot either. Um, so I don't know exactly what's going on with that, but obviously when you compare these to the bigger, ones they the 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 wheel the tires are considerably smaller um and it seems like it makes a big difference but as far as mowing goes uh it, it cuts great and it's really the smoothest mower that i have mowed with it's um it's just uh like i say it's just not my favorite just because of the way it sets on heels and the way it scoots around but definitely a great great mower and if you're looking for a good ride th this is the way to go if you notice they're, they're real similar to the snappers so you can actually get a snapper uh a little cheaper and it be you know off of the same uh platform you know kind of same design as this so i hope this video helped and you know feel free to add more info as as you uh, may know quite a bit more about these somebody that's mowed with them a lot more like i said just me trying out this is kind of what i've gathered off of it and uh just thought i would share it so thank you for watching